Say hi, hi. We just left off with um describing the, a location that the onna koshaku lives in. Do you know what atsume maru means? Gather. Right, like. gather. And can you read this kanji? Maru. Hi, 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 hi. And what is the ta form of atsumaru? Atsumata. And can you read the sentence for me? Machutsushi tachi wa mise no mae ni atsumata. The magicians, they gather in front of the door. Perfect. And how do you read this kanji? Tsukuru. Hi, hi. So Amatinami is basically the um the cityscape. So when you look at the city from like as like an appearance, they're like, ah, oh, the houses are all nice and look like that. So that's <laughs> how the light the houses like line up in a city so that you kind of know what the city looks like is the matinami um what did it start with Mati. hi hi can you read the sentence for me Next guy is the servant. The servant of the Duchess. Kutta, meaning created. Right. Produced the machinani. Created the the, the like the spread mm. or the layout, the layout of the city. Yeah. Right. Perfect. Do you know how to read that kanji in the bowl? You read it earlier today. See if you know how to read it without the um, furigana. Uh, you gure yashiki. Perfect. And this word started with machi. Do you know what this kanji in the middle is? Na nami. Ah, uh, yes. Do you know what utsukushi means? Utsukushi, delicate or beautiful. Beautiful, hi, hi, hi. Can you read this for me? Akebo no. Machi no. No, 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 no. This is he or guy. It is guy, hi. Agebo no guy. The rising, like the dawn, Hi. the dawn district. Hi. Akebo no guy. No. Machinami wa. Ushi. Utsuku, utsukushi. The layout of the dawn district. That, that view, it's beautiful. Right. That landscape. So sorry. Do you know what this um word is? Muzukashi. Muzukashi wa mo. Oh, no, the bolded word is. Mukashi. The bolded word is kinmachi. Good guess. It's actually kanemochi. 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 Kin's a hard kanji. Do you know what kin uh kanemochi means? It's a wealthy person. So okay. so so. Well. Zeitaku means extravagance, and it is a na adjective. So going above and beyond. Zeitaku. So let's go read this sentence. Akebo no kai ni 
贅沢な屋敷と金持ちの住,住,人住人が集まった。The resident, the wealthy resident. はい。Wealthy residents. And、はい、the The over the top mansion, the mansions that is over the top, beyond over the top, what over the top of the Don district.、Hmm? They gathered. So the wealthy and the mansions. They gathered. Hi. Where?、Oh, at the Don District. Perfect. So, this gathering doesn't have to be like I decided to gather. It's kind of like talking about a bunch of things are in a certain location. So, the Don District, it basically has these things. These things were gathered to this location, like brought to the location, like they settled in this location in this context, I suppose. Uh, which were rich people, and of course, over the top mansions, because that's where the rich people are living in, right? Which people want over the top, scravagant mansions. So these are gathered、Money. in that location. Hi. We are saying this Sumatta because Sumatta is the, basically, is the self, is the passive form. So, in other words, we're not, we don't. We're not concerned about the, 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 the volition of the people involved. We're just saying、hey. these things happen, right? Hi,、hey, hi.、Hey. That's probably right. It's、um, intransitive if you know what the big words mean. s Right. Intransitive, you know, right? Marked by the God. Hi.、Hey. Um, do you happen to remember that kanji? Vipana. Hi, hi, hi. Which is basically the same as they talk, right? Magnificent. Yeah, like magnificent, right? right.、Awesome. Beautiful, excellent. Okay, so now we get to go read the line from the book. A table no guy. Me. A ze takuna. Hi. Yashiki to. Tane mochi no. Junin to. Ipana. Nise ga. So the at the Don district, the the over the you know over the over the top or、oh, beyond over the top mansion and the wealthy resident and the magnificent store. They all gathered here at the Don District. Hi. And it's a Matutsi, Matutsuki Kachika, Mahol de Utsuku Ki, Matinami O, Utte Iru. And here they use the Iru form of this Utte. Hi. Meaning they are doing, right? This is the present. Kind of. It, it, it's, I guess you could say like they're overseeing this still. They're it's making still sure they're making sure it's continuing to sit, stay utsukushi. But they're not necessarily like building it right now. Like it's not necessarily under construction, but they're maintaining it, I guess is why it's in um, iru form. So here it s a y that the magicians with 
magic or using magic, they created or they created king the landscape, the beautiful landscape. Hi, 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 hi. Hi. Perfect. And now we're doing kanji check, but do you know what a goten was? Goten. Then referring to the that uh, the building itself. Right. Um, what kind building of building inside of the complex? The, right. the the actual main building. The, right. It's a palace or like the castle, basically. The the palace. Hi. Um. A te um taku te taku would be the mansion. That's inside of the estate that was Yashiki. So Yashiki was the estate. Teitaku is the mansion inside of the estate. And Goten is the palace or the castle. So Goten is a little bit more fancy than a Teitaku. Um, do you know what ka uh, this kanji is? It's so to lend or to borrow i think in this case it is to borrow to borrow the help hi 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 Kari -kari -kari to borrow Kari -kari -kari. perfect and how about higashigawa on the eastern bank perfect. eastern bank of the river hi do you know what a hiruma what hiruma means Hiruma is the time span. Mm, what kind of time? Wait, which time? It is a span yeah, of time. It's the, it's the day. It's the daytime. It's the time daytime. where the light is out. Hi, hi, hi. Which ended with ma. What did it start with? Hiru. Hi, 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 hi. Um, what is the negative form of to go in Japanese? Ikanai. Perfect. Can you read the sentence for me? Dorobo wa iruma no tembo no kai ni kanai hogai. The hogai is saying it would be better if this happened. Right. Hypothetical statement. Right. Um, don't go. It would be better not to leave. Either use it can it can to go, right? To go. Go where? Go to the destination marked by me. Hi. First of all, what's it our subject be... of the sentence? Who is ikanai? Hypothetically. Dorobo. So, so. Dorobo is ikanai. So it would be better if the dorobo oh. did not iku to hiruma no akebo no gai. Right. It would be better not to go to the, to the dawn district of the morning. Hi. During daylight, hi. So the thief is should not go. Uh, Hiruma mm -hmm. is, you know, like around the afternoon. So it's anytime I'd say around 9 a.m. to like 3 p.m. maybe. So daylight is a good way of translating it. But it's it's not like the early morning and it's not the late evening. So so the dawn district of this time period, it would be best for the thief to not go to that location. So a thief should not go to the dawn district during the afternoon. That's a good idea. Um, Dokubo is a single cell. And by this, we're not talking about the mitochondria. We're talking about a jail cell. It's a single jail cell. 
、独房。Can you read this for me? Oh, it's supposed to be Kono, not Tono. どうの、どうの、どうの、どうの、どうの、どうの、どうの、どうの、どうの、どうの、どう Perfect. And the thing I was talking about earlier,、um, so if you see two quotation marks, this is probably said. So I was wrong earlier about the sweet t h i k o i Nobody definitely says that because it has the quotation marks. And if they don't actually say it, you're not going to see quotation marks. So that will be when you'll see like some other word here. They'll be saying they shake their stick as if to say and stuff like that. Or they were about to say and things, which will not be in quotation marks. So. They're really on it in Japanese.、Um, how do you think you read this word? Uchikomu. Uchikomu. Uchi is to beat up. Kind of. Hi, hi, hi.、Um, but u c h i k o m u Oh, no, no, no. To slam something into something. Yes,、right? it is the slamming version of that. Because komu. Adds into, so buchikoma means like the throw into somewhere, but it, it means it like very like aggressively. So, like slamming is a good way of thinking of it. The slam someone into a location, the shove them. Do you remember what mitai meant? It's not yoni, not a simile. It, it is similar to yoni, but a little bit different. It, You're right. It's an appearance. It's, an, it's, it's, a, it's describing someone's actual appearance. They、Hi. do, in fact, look like something. Right. It can be that. Not just me. This specific、imagining. sentence is very similar to a yoni. So if you, you, could, you could have this with yoni. You could say, Ichitami no yoni, kiteru. You could say that if you wanted to. That would be、um, grammatically correct. But it, Feels a little bit、um, different. Yoni feels more separated. That, it, it feels more distant. And、uh, so, Mitai feels a little bit closer, like a m o t h e r So, Yoni feels more like an official simile. Well, Mitai. You mean feels closer more as in. Metaphor like. Closer、maybe. as in close. Closer as in closer to the actual、uh, metaphor, right? Yeah, I, I would say in, that's like the big difference. It is, in fact, very close to being an ishi tarama, tarami. <laughs> yeah, tarami. that could be a way you could think about it.、Um, but both mitai and yoni are basically both kind of similar similes. They both basically mean like, right? It's, it doesn't actually mean you look. Like something, like you look the same, like it's not onaji. <laughs>、uh, it just means, for example, this is cold, it's cold like、um, a stone. Cold like stone, it's not can, actually cold.、Uh, yeah. Can I review the simile? So, there's, I think there's another one, right? So, the similes are yoni,、uh, mitai, so. soni, sona.、Uh, so, sona. I guess you can also use Sony. We use Sony with negative. So, so on that. Like,、Sony、yeah, I mean,、negative. that was, um, Yaku ni tachi Sony nai, I believe, was the, that one, which is they do not look like they're useful. Um, so、oh, is kind of like a, a hypothesis. Yoni. And mitai are not hypotheses. These are just like similes, as in you're comparing an item in order for you to understand what we're talking about. So, this is cold. Well, how cold it is? Well, it's cold like a rock. It is as cold as a rock of the cold pavestone rock that I've walked on on my bare feet when it's been raining. 
So that's what the mitaini and yoni does. So would be a little bit weird here because so is just like a hypothesis based off of information you've gathered. Like I looked at this boy and he looks useless, but I'm not comparing him to anything. Mitai and yoni are comparisons. And they're basically interchangeable. I, okay, that makes so much sense. Um, so is not comparing to anything. I it just look a certain way. So, so. Exactly. Um, do you remember what Buchikoma meant? Slam into. Hi, hi, hi. Slam into, the throw into. What is the passive form of that? Passive. Ooh, verb. Hi. Uchiko ma reru. Perfect. Nice. I was slammed in. Can you read the sentence for me? Sentence. Norobo mitai. Ua. Ubo ni. Na yatsu wa, what is that? Uh, you don't know what yatsu means? Yatsu is that guy. Hi, hi, hi. Of it. But na, so na here is, is, is used as a modifier. So mitai. So mitai, mitai surprisingly, itself. is not an e adjective, it is a na adjective. Okay. So Dorobo Mitai na Yatsu, the guy that looks like the thief, got he got slammed into the jail cell. Perfect. Hi. And if you wanted to, you could just place this mitaina with no yona. And it would still be um grammatically. Dorobo no yo na yatsu. Um, I guess the difference is that Yona feels more like you're describing his behavior in this context than Mitai feels like you are talking about his appearance, but it's kind of not, it's like a very small right. like difference. Like if I said, Doro no Yona Yatsu, I feel like maybe he's like creeping around the room on his tiptoes or something. Hi, hi. Um, okay. But. Like in general, it's interchangeable. Uh, what is the Thai form of to go? I mean, I want to go. Thai form. Thai form. No. No. Thai. Classic. I, or you might have said ikitai. Hi. Is that right? So it's a uh, ki tai because we're adding an e, but we gotta keep keep the k. And drop that e. Ikitai. So ikitai. Perfect. I want. Um, this word right here started with hiru. 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 What did it end with? Hiruma. Day. Day time. Hiruma. Can you read the sentence for me? I want to go to the Don district during the day. Perfect. So now you get to go read the line from the book, and this will probably be our last line of the day. Yona. Onna shoku, onna koshaku no shokubo ni buchikomare tak o buchikomare taku nakereba. Um, it say if you do not want to be slammed into the dungeon of the Duchess. Oremitai na yatsu wa 
um, um, a, a guy that looked a person that looks like me. Um, he 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 no agebo no kai ni wa. The the dawn district during the day, ikanai ho ga i. It's best it's best not to go. Hi. Best not to go to the dawn district during the day for a person that looks like me. If you don't want to get slammed into the dungeon of the dungeon. As I said, you could easily replace that with no yona, and it would be the same. I would say in this context, it, there'd be no difference. Both would be like totally the same. Uh, but yeah, hi. Basically, if you if you look like a thief, you shouldn't go in the Don district. Good advice from Khan. Thank you. <laughs> hi, but he started off his his very first sentence of the book is, "The magician is like a thief." Oh, so. But here he say ore ni tai, and he keeps thinking he's a magician. So <laughs> <laughs> a magician like me magician. should not go here. <laughs> so so you're a dishy no. now. You're you're dishy now, Dorobo. You you don't need to be worried about Akebono guy. What are you worried about? 